I've been going on tour recently playing NBA 2K20 on every single platform that it's offered on. But I bet y'all didn't know this, I'm a PC gamer. Oh yeah, I've switched as of two years ago. I don't play on consoles no more. Everything except racing games and sports games, that's it. So today, I wanna try NBA 2K20 on PC. You might be wondering, AJ, what prompted you to make such a decision? I'm just perusing, doing what I usually do. Just taking a look at what's going on in the video game industry. I'm on Steam and come to find out, somehow NBA 2K20 has 10,000 active players and it's 2 a.m. right now. I was bamboozled. Just to give you an idea of how healthy of a player base that is on Steam, Rainbow Six, which is an incredibly popular game on Steam, has 45,000 people playing. And to give you a picture of what the tippity top looks like, even at 2 a.m., Counter-Strike Go is getting 270,000 active players. That's, that's how many people are playing right now. So if you're getting anything over eight or 9,000, that means your game is doing good. And I'm not gonna lie to you, when I was looking at 2K20's numbers, I was fully expecting like 1,000, 1,500. So I wanna give it a chance. There's people playing the game. There's a community of people playing on PC. So I'm trying to see what's changed. PC is a much better platform in general. At any given moment, I could play at 300 FPS with 144 Hertz. It is a more superior gaming experience by any metric. You won't catch me playing a shooter on console. Why? I have a 2080 Ti in my PC. That'd be crazy. So any chance I get, if the game performs better on PC, I play it and get the game on PC, period. What? That's... You gotta love PC gaming. Cause I would love to be able to just casually change my keybinds on console. But the only way to do that on PlayStation is to change your keybinds for every game. I don't wanna do it for every game, I just wanna do it for this specific one. Uh, so in case you didn't know, you can still do the head scan stuff uh, on PC. Do you care? Probably not. Right, let's move on. Oh, not this again. I love you, LD, but not this again. Okay, I'm gonna see y'all when I get to the park. Okay, um, we made it to the playground. I can let you know right now, the park is active. <laughs> Cause ideally the PC has the most potential of any platform. The game is developed on PC. How could you f it up? And on top of that, you can mod the game on PC, which means there's so much potential. I mean, think about CSGO. Yeah, the game is popping, sure. But there's also a f ton of really fun mods. And that's what kind of keeps people interested in the game too. All right, so I gotta kind of make my player look less bummy real quick. All right, you gotta go drip him out. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> Boom, ugly sweaters. Why does it cost this much? Bro, why are they playing music, bro? Ronnie, you trying to take my money? You just took my money. Ronnie, I just gave you another $50. Transaction complete. Now I can get swagged out. <laughs> Ooh, that was a good pun. No, it wasn't. Sorry, guys. All right, check out the drip. We got boom, the sweater. Boom. You know what I mean? Like I play a little bit of golf in my spare time. And we got the Puma headband. <laughs> you, you, might, you mean to tell me you wouldn't me if you see me walk around like this in real life. All right, uh, 85 overall, dripped out. And now let's see if I can get a game. Oh no, I gotta get my jump shot right. Are you, oh, I don't have jump shot creator, no. <laughs> that means I'm gonna have to go with good old trusty Kevin Love. I'm gonna let y'all know right now, if you don't have a jump shot creator and you don't have quick draw, this is the greatest release in the game. You're welcome. Oh, people can have spaces in their names and because it's PC. Look at these guys with three letter names. They must be hackers. <laughs> the theory is that the reason PS4s, PS4 Pros, Xbox Ones have problems in the park is because it's outdated hardware, right? The performance just isn't there, it's old consoles. Now, I have a beast of a PC. I mean a beast of a PC. So unless the game is just optimized horribly on this port, which is very much possible, I should have no frame drops. I shouldn't have to experience that Guys, is this what you guys had to go through to get games? This is tragic. So if you were wondering, maybe the graphics are better on PC? Mm-mm, just like they are on PS4 Pro. Is there game chat? No, there's no game chat. Oh, whoa, what is this experience? Why is it so choppy? What the hell? Okay, so I guess it's not optimized on PC. 
Uh, as per. You couldn't expect that from 2K, could you? Pick it up. Pick, go, go! Green. Boom. Buckets. I can't communicate with my team because there's no game chat. So what's the chances that guy is a hacker just based off his name? Hey, I'm wide open in case he was wondering. Right here. Oh, we don't pass on PC. We just shoot whites. That's all we do on PC. Bro, are you capable of clicking X? This is the worst gaming experience. I'm playing with bums that won't pass. I swear to God. Bro, I'm not f***ing inbounding to you no more. Are you gonna click X? I'm wide. You passed to him? I'm wide open. But he's not gonna click X. He'd rather do all of that shit. Green up, let's go. Buckets. I'm right here. Did He's hacking. He's hacking. Mike, ban him. He shot. So, all right, bet. He's a demigod. <laughs> Steal it from him. He literally has a Jesus. People on PC fucking suck. Based off this one game, I'm making a, dra a drastic generalization. <laughs> Give me that board. <laughs> we lost. <laughs> I would rather be homeless for one week than to ever repeat a game quite like this. I'm about to report him. What's his name? How do I know which one of these he is? Well, I gotta go and check. I gotta report the right guy. Uh, four and then, no, five and then three. Oh, I, there's no reporting feature. Cool. He's a 60 <laughs> Okay, so he's a hacker. All right. Because he was using Playmaker dribble moves. <laughs> So let's play with another one of those guys. See how that goes. <laughs> and you hopped off. Like, you're big buddy. So there's no point of even playing this game on PC unless you're already coming with a squad. You can't expect to play with randoms because one, you're gonna have an infuriating experience, and two, there's no way to talk to anybody to get games. Can you imagine 2K with the uncapped frame rate, optimized properly with good servers on PC, game chat and mods? I'm telling you right now, is game, set, match, done, everybody be buying the game on PC. But 2K can't do that because they're often partnered with Xbox or PlayStation. So if they make a superior product on PC, which there's no partner for, it's gonna be a problem. I'm right here, I'm right here, wide. If, yeah, go ahead, shoot your zero bar. Good shot, bud. Look at, look at the defense. Look at the defense. Look at the defense. Oh, maybe not. Look at the defense, actually. Look at it. <laughs> oh, I, I've never seen that animation air ball. That's a good release. Maybe not. And he just, he just dunking on everybody today. Okay, it's like that then. Oh, look at the pass I made. I'm right behind you, pay attention. That's a good release. Is there a reason these are like not even close? I'm a little confused. On the Google Stadia, the PS4, the Xbox, every platform I've played this game on, Kevin Love release has been the same. Why does it feel different on PC? I, I shot a half bar and I'm telling you right now, it's not my fault. There's something weird about this port. Shoot it! I believe in you, teammate. Oh, we just all chucking up bricks. The reason I'm really hard on 2K when it comes to the PC port is because it should be the easiest to develop on PC. You don't have to worry about Xbox and PlayStation and how accessible the platform is and how easy it is to port to that specific platform. No, the game is designed on this platform, on PC. There's no real ceiling when it comes to performance. Really just depends on how good a PC you have. You can mod the game on PC, so there's really just infinite possibilities when it comes to the game. It is scary how quiet it is. Wow! If you don't have to send the signal to the PlayStation servers or the Xbox servers, shouldn't the latency theoretically be lower on PC? I just don't understand how in 2020 they could release this game and then not put things like game chat in here. But I'm happy at least that PC is getting updates, like the winter updates, the fall updates, and all of that. Because even though this does feel like a neglected port, it just has way too much potential. That's what makes me angry. The best version of any game, but especially 2K, should be on PC. But as long as 2K is striking deals with PlayStation one year and then Xbox the next year, the chances they release a way better version of the same game on a platform they're not partnered with very unlikely. Hi! To one of the 10,000 people playing, can you guys join the wreck? 
Uh, now's a good time to plug my merch, guys. I have all kinds of fantastic designs. If you wanna support the channel, the link is in the description. Okay, here, here's a good idea. 2K, are you listening? Probably not, you rarely do. Let's say that there's an update that's about to drop. Before you drop the update for PS4 and Xbox, because there's always unnecessary side effects to every update, just have a technical test server, like Rainbow Six and plenty of other games do. Drop it on Steam. What went wrong? Check. Is that a 10,000 VC game? What the f happened? I stopped playing 2K for one week, I come back and this is like the high rollers or what? I don't wanna play one more game. And I know this time I'm gonna score a bucket. I feel like I, this is just one server. Am I bugging right now? Cause I remember seeing those names. Do they only have one park server? What the f is going on? Hey guys, join me. <laughs> I need, I need, I need friends to play with. <laughs> now we got a player. We got, we got two big, I don't, okay, okay. All right, fellas, let's do it. I can't talk to you guys, we can't communicate, but that's okay. Yeah, so on the intros, the game is 30 frames per second, but the second you get into the game, it jumps to 60 frames per second. I, I got you, I got you, I'm always there for my teammates, man. Oh yeah. Don't pass it, I mean, just pass it to me then. All right, so that's, how did that, how did that go in? Damn, I'm getting no help on these screens. <laughs> All right, interesting, very interesting. Can you shoot? Can you shoot? Oh, you can't. All right, so you just did that for no reason. I always trust my teammates, and I should stop trusting them immediately. Oh, this one guy is AFK. We most definitely should be getting buckets. How are you missing? The guy is not playing. Guys, I'm losing my mind. What are you doing? Why are you guys playing like this? <laughs> are we trolling? Is that what's happening? <laughs> Oh, he greened it. Okay, I didn't think he could shoot. <laughs> what are you doing? Why are you dribbling like that? I, all right. I'm, not, I'm gonna stop asking questions. I'm just gonna assume every weird thing that happens makes sense on PC. Can we win a game? Can I score a bucket? All these questions will be answered here this game, fellas. I'm wide open in case you didn't see me. Oh, you're too busy dunking on heads. I see you. This is such an odd platform. I was in the lane and I clicked square. Look at the screen he set. Did you see the screen? Who the f was that supposed to hit? I'm out! Oh, all right. Oh, it's game point, baby! Let's go! Please don't blow a coverage. Oh, they already blew it. Boards! We're out! Let's go! I see you, teammate. I see you. Teammate, get us the win! Get us the win! Let's go! Achievement unlocked. Winning. <laughs> There you go, Agent, you did it, you won a game. Achievement, that's an achievement for you, congratulations. All right, so I just wanna explain why I think that the PC can be the future for 2K. There is entire communities of people that play NBA 2K20 on PC, and they just create a whole bunch of mods that you might enjoy. Like this one here has all, not all, but I don't know, I don't watch EuroLeague, but it has a whole lot of EuroLeague teams, and it's showing different screenshots of the players. Look at these graphics and designs. This doesn't exist in 2K20. I guess it's just people with time on their hands because they'll recreate, I don't have it on. They'll even recreate the face scans for certain NBA players to match what they look like at a certain point in their life or what they look like right now. Back in NBA 2K16, I remember there was mods that you can download that it made it possible for you to change any characteristic about the player that you wanted. You could make his wingspan like 50 feet long if you wanted. Sure. That made room for a lot of hacking and issues on the online, but it was also a lot of fun. You just need a way to regulate this kind of stuff. It goes with any game. There's no way to report people? That's insane. I don't even know what all of this is that I'm looking at, but I just know that people made it. <laughs> and not 2K developers, just people. So when I'm on Steam and I randomly find out that for some reason NBA 2K20 in December is still pulling 10,000 active players? That's insane. That means that there is an appetite for this platform. I just wanna see it get a little bit more attention, that's all. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you got, no, that's how fucking weird people end videos. Hey, there's a video right here and a whole not, just, you can do whatever you want, to be honest with you. <laughs> click on a video on the screen, click on the YouTube logo at the top left, head somewhere else. 
Or just walk out the door and do something outside. It's up to you. 